Well, my friends, it is New Year's or New Year's Eve. And so New Year's, in a tradition in my wife's family, uh, which was not a tradition in my family, was that you had to eat ham and black-eyed peas on New Year's Day. Again, it's not a tradition that, that I did in my family. But every year, we have black-eyed peas one time a year. Because it turns out we don't really love black-eyed peas, but we eat it once a year for tradition's sake, right? Well, it turns out I sat there and started looking for some frozen dinners that had black-eyed peas. Turns out there aren't a whole lot, but I did find Amy's Bowls, brown rice, black-eyed peas, and veggies in a flavorful tamari ginger sauce. And then it says plant-based, which I would assume because it has vegetables in it. Anyway, the picture does look good. I look forward to the broccoli and the mushrooms and stuff like that. Now, I paid $5.49 for this bowl, so it's a little on the pricey side. It's a bowl. And, oh look, it comes in a another plastic sleeve. Okay, fine. But is, is that couscous? And the fact that I know how to say couscous kind of is weird for me. So we have black eyed peas all over here. And then couscous and maybe not a whole lot of vegetables. We, here, here are the nutrition facts. I, I will give it not a lot of calories here, 290. Now, microwave oven. Ooh, you also have toaster oven directions. <laughs> Maybe I should find a toaster oven and put it in the office here. But do not remove overwrap. Interesting. So I'm supposed to cook for two and a half minutes, so I'm supposed to leave this wrap on. Okay. Now, I, this is my first time ever getting an Amy's bowl, so maybe that's normal. Then I cook for two and a half minutes. I remove the overwrap, stir, and cook on high for another two minutes. Let's sit one minute. I wonder if it's supposed to keep the moisture in or something. Okay. Well, I'm going to try this and see what happens. All right. We are out of the microwave. There are definitely black eyed peas in here, but there's not a whole lot, interestingly. I'm gonna try some of these guys. All right, they're, they were peas, they're, they're not very flavorful. Let's try this broccoli. Hallelujah, okay, I'll give Amy credit here. That is perhaps the best piece of broccoli I have ever had in a TV dinner. I mean, short of it being fresh, uh, it, it, it was juicy, yet somehow crunchy at the same time, and very flavorful. I've, I've never had so much flavor short of it being fresh. Uh, I'm going to try some couscous here. All right, it, not a lot of flavor with the couscous. I'm going to try this carrot. I, I didn't hate the carrot, but it wasn't mind-blowing or earth-shattering or anything. It's actually a little, little not, not a whole lot of, not as much flavor as I was hoping, but better than some. Here's the mushroom. Now, I'm excited about the mushroom because I can smell, interestingly enough, other than the broccoli, I can smell some of the mushroom, so I'm hoping this is a good mushroom. And I think smell is all I'm gonna get from the mushroom. That was mm, disappointing. Okay, let's get a big spoonful here in the middle of everything. So one thing I've noticed is I'm not really getting, there's supposed to be this ginger, tamari, tamari, somebody correct me in the pronunciation there, tamari ginger sauce, and I'm just not tasting that. All right, now I know why. Uh, I, I didn't tell this earlier, I should have told this earlier, but when I was searching for a, a fast food dinner, some black eyed peas, uh, I came across that most of them don't even have black eyed peas in them, but this Amy's Bowl brown rice, black eyed peas. So it's brown rice, not couscous. Is it brown rice that I've been eating? So it is. How embarrassing for me. But I, I did a search, and like the only store within a 20 mile radius, and I live in a fairly populated area, that carried this was a Kroger. So I bought this at Kroger for $5.49. And not even a lot of the Krogers were carrying this. And so I drove, this one was only about like four miles away from my house, so it wasn't too bad. So I drove over there specifically to pick this up, and now I know why. This is just, I, I don't hate it, there's nothing here where I'm like, oh, I gotta spit it out. And to be fair, I was thinking that I was gonna spit it out because of the black eyed peas or something like that. And I really do love the broccoli, but it's just so bland, okay? So I want some flavor, and there is no flavor. Maybe if they threw in some more of this ginger sauce, though, to be fair, I'm not tasting the ginger sauce, so I might have hate it. And so I'm, I'm going to eat all of this for my lunch because I, I hate wasting money, but uh, I'm never going to buy this again. And, and it's just so disappointing, so bland. To be fair, the, I, the one time I probably will buy this is if I'm ever alone on New Year's Day again. I will buy this because of the black eyed peas and carry on the tradition that my wife introduced me to. So other than that though, I am never going to buy this again. So, oh man, this is the last video of the year and I, I, I'm going to give a meh to a thumbs down, okay? I'm not going to buy it again. And if you buy it, great, because to be fair, it's like 290 calories and some vitamins and got the black eyed peas. So again, as, uh, other than that one rare circumstance, I would buy it again under that one very specific circumstance. But otherwise, I'm never going to buy this again, but I'm not spitting it out either. So I can't recommend this, but 
I, I can't sit there and say that you're going to be disgusted by it or anything like that. I mean, just, just by just about anything else. If you like my reviews, please hit like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. And I've got videos and playlists on either side here that I think you might enjoy. Until next time, bye!